it's here. It's zippy. It's exciting. And it's good. Check it out, guys. This is the Cycloid by Zippy. And my god, I've been flipping this for the good part of the last hour, and I will tell you right now, uh, better than expected, for sure. This was $84 on his uh, Zippy website. I forget the, uh, the exact link name, but look at that. This is the Cycloid, I think it was called the Skeleton, although I got the blue design. Um, runs on bearings, it's channel design handles. It is 3D printed, as you can tell, I'm sure. And it does come with a um, bite handle indicator, although it does not come with this one. It actually came with the one underneath this blue rub. Yeah, right here. This uh, transparent one is what it came with. And I'll get to this in a minute, but I wanna talk about the cycloid. So this thing is fantastic. It performs all the tricks I throw at it consistently. You know, I mean like, that's all I can ask for a trainer to do is perform my tricks consistently. So I can enjoy it because it's not fun when I can't, you know, do all my tricks all the time with whatever I'm using. So it is definitely, in my opinion, a jack of all trades beater. And I say beater because at least for me, when I have knives and I want to either keep them nice or beat them, it comes down to, do they have good tolerances? Do they have no tap? So on and so forth. Are they expensive? And this being under $90, as well as being 3D printed, so it's very durable. This blade, uh, Zippy himself posts videos on his Instagram where he just smashes this thing. It will not snap. It doesn't break. Same goes for the handles. And if it does, good customer service. He'll fix it up for you. Send it over as well. You know, if you don't like something about it, the weight's weird. You can ask him about modding. I've heard that he's very open to helping people um, mod all their like special requests, and I think that's cool. So yeah, as far as customer service, if you go with a Zippy product like the Cycloid, you will be getting you know good response time, good care, good customer service, and. More importantly, above else, a knife that will perform well and last you. So I think that's very important. I think this is a great starting point for someone that's looking to get into the flipping and they don't want to go over a hundred bucks, but you know, oops, Zippy is just a good starting point for someone that wants to get good and wants to learn and have something that can help them learn. So I think the cycloid does that very well. Now, as far as you know, learning tricks, some people might not like the lighter weight of this. And, you know, I understand that. I will want to, I will compare it because I have some more 3D printed knives here with me. Um, I do not currently have my Squiddy with me, but I will say, I think this flips better than a Squiddy, hands down. Now, there are perks to the Squiddy. You know, there are the screws you can adjust and take out. Um... But are those also the like Squiddy B with the silencers on the blade? But you know, Squiddy doesn't have bite handle indicator on the blade. It it does have cases where this blade or the handles will snap when people drop it too many times or in a weird way. But I don't believe that's something you would have to worry about with this product. Um, also, the Squiddy does not run on bearings. This runs on bearings, so super smooth flippability action when you just you know or fanning it around or spinning it, you can just feel there's no resistance. Um, and I can appreciate that for a plastic trainer because I definitely have had times where I get resistance on my Squiddy. So that's not fun. As well as I've felt resistance on this before. This is the uh, Oni, P Oni, um, 3D printed knife. This thing basically feels like a longer cycloid. But, of course, this isn't as durable. Um, this bends all the way as well as these bend, but I don't want to talk about this too much. Um, I will say this blade has broken on me before, and in a month's time, a year's time, I guarantee you this is not going to break on me. And if it does, I can get it fixed because Zippy cares about their customers from what I've seen. Now, this is an Etsy rubber trainer. 
nothing special it's 17 bucks i custom it myself but when i go to flip all of these that's 3d printed you know this is also 3d printed it's just in hand performing every trick that i know how to do i like this i think this is going to be a new go-to daily carry for me because i like to carry you know a aluminum or steel knife and i also like to carry a beater when i'm over concrete and so on and so forth so this is a good go-to recommend it um if you want something that's not going to get scuffed and scratched and maybe break when you drop it you know like the volp will get scuffed and scratched but this i mean really it's not going to get scratched like it's plastic you know and it's bendable durable plastic no snaps, no scuffs. I mean, it's going to scuff, but, like, it's not when you scuff, like, an aluminum blade and the steel showing and just throws off and it's contrasting. You're not going to have that with a 3D printed knife. So, those are my thoughts right now on this. I will have to give it more time, but I would definitely recommend this right out of the box. This is a great trainer. So, what else did I get? I got the Bermuda uh, little spacer on the blade where you can adjust the weight in your blade. And so I actually threw that on my custom squid trainer with the Bermuda blade. Why not? So this is what it looks like in the blade. It's very flush and I didn't need any glue or anything. It just stuck right in and it, it stays in there. Um, I mean, my gosh, this thing, it feels great. And it definitely helps with the weight because I, oops, I am a pretty crazy person when it comes to customization on battle songs. And <laughs> this just all looks amazing together. I mean, look at the colors contrast as it flips. I love that. Um, as well as on here, I put some Squid Industries bite indicators on top of some zippy bite handle indicators. And that was only because when I open this, or excuse me, when I close this, if I didn't put this adjustable or this um, custom screw in with the silencers to stop the handle clap, then, you know, these would stop handle clap. So it's just like a kind of customization that you can do um, when you have Zippy products that are made to be very flexible and fixed. They will fit most of your trainers. Like I can throw this on 90% of my knives and it'll fit. No questions asked. I don't even have to check. I also have this one, which I will be putting on another Bermuda that is coming um, in the mail. Because I want to stock Bermuda still. But as far as my custom one, I think this came out very nicely. This does go in the dark, I believe. So, um, I'm happy. I'm happy with what i gotten. Everything is flipping how I want it to flip. Everything's feeling how I want it to feel. Um, I mean, I just don't have any complaints right now. I'd recommend getting this if you're a beginner, if you're someone that likes to collect knives, if you're someone that likes 3D printed knives, or you like something cheap that you can beat all day. Oops. I think my thoughts have all been said. Get the cycloid, get Zippy products, good customer service, goodbye. And yeah.